uh, and also you were uh, sp- speaking of Kev- you were, uh, you had a sex doll ball buster. Yeah, my mom used to work for Playboy, so uh, she used to get at home. She's a model. No, she was a merchandiser. She would she would uh, do uh, which so, page? Uh, <laughs> not that I would share that with you. <laughs> <laughs> Funny story. I used to people who uh, in school they would ask me, you know, what does she do there? I always told them that she was a pubic hair designer. Ooh. <laughs> Four years of art school. <laughs> Working on the curls, exactly those, those seventy, you know, large exactly. poofs. You gotta make it look like a bush. Yeah. Man. Um. But yeah, she was a merchandiser, so she get home a lot of random shit, and w- one of those random things that she's that she brought home was a sex doll. Sure. And mm-hmm. for the kids, exactly for the kids. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's it, why. It's like the old school ones, though, where it's like a inflatable, right? Yeah. Like a inflatable raft. Pretty much. Yeah. yeah. I think she bought it for my dad for when he's for when he was feeling lonely. Oh, oh I know. <laughs> How how nice of him, That's right? Nice Sweet. Yeah, but uh, so I having a couple of friends over, and we're just drinking, smoking a little, smoking some, and my buddy, my buddy sees this sex doll, and I'm a virgin at the time, so he's just trying to give me sex lessons. <clears throat> he's like, yeah, you know, when your girl really wants it, you just tease her with it a little bit, you know, just just rub it on her, and then just and just pull it away, and the <laughs> girls that'll drive him nuts. I've later found out that's not true. <laughs> But anyway, did you accidentally pull the cap? Oh, that's the spot. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! But he's uh, he's getting he's getting really into it, just fucking with me. He's but when a girl really really wants it, you just slam it right into her and take it right back out. She'll go huh? Ah! very very fast. I'm like, oh really? But when a girl is fucking really really nuts, you gotta fuck her against something. So he goes to my refrigerator I had in, my, in there, and literally is humping it against. Against the uh, against against the refrigerator, but like you would think it would dip down lower, yeah. but somehow it was bouncing off the refrigerator. So I get up and start yelling at him, Gary, Gary, you're gonna bust my mom's sex doll, which I, a sentence I never thought I ever had to say in my life. <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, "Oh fuck you, Kevin!" And he starts running around with it, and they had these hard plastic fetish feet that somehow one of the feet just went around in a circle and shot me square in the fucking nuts. Oh. Oh. Yeah. So then after this happens, I fall on my knees. My buddy drops the uh, drops the sex doll, laughing his ass off. My other friend takes off his shirt and his pants, puts a broom up the off the up the sex doll's ass, and starts walking around the yard like you know, like like I was carrying a fucking pitchfork, That's going fun. hi ho, hi ho. Dude, I I yeah. just realized after that pitchfork thing, I've been doing it all wrong. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. Is that what the festival's all about? I think so. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so I got a pretty natural fear of sex dolls now. No. Sure. Yeah, we're as, as we were moving out of our house in Lombard. That was uh, we we're cleaning up my mom's closet, and we and mm-hmm. we found it. We ended up disembo- We ended up cutting it all up and uh, leaving all the hands and legs sticking out of our garbage can. That's, the fu- the fuck that's with healthy. Our, the fuck with our garbage man. Sure. <laughs> yeah, that's good, man. Yeah, that's yeah, that's normal. That's good. I uh I saw a cartoon recently. Um. Cause it was a like I was raising all these old Polish cartoons when my grandma was around, but I'm like, oh, I want to catch up on my speaking because everybody in my factory speaks Polish. Yeah. So I'm like, so I saw this cartoon. I think I mentioned it before about it's called Yes Jerzy, which is just translates to Jerry the Hedgehog. Yeah. And it's about this hedgehog who smokes weed and gets drunk and he like fucks all these girls, and um his enemy is this guy who had his heart broken because. Oh. Uh, he took the girlfriend he had a crush on yeah. in, when he, when they were five. So like as they got older, he became a Nazi skinhead. Hmm. So he's trying to get his Nazi gang after them. And the the way that they get back to the movie's about the way they get back at him is they clone him as a zombie. Yeah. So he terrorizes the town. And one of the ways he terrorizes it is he goes to the local sex shop and he fills all the dolls with helium. So that it looks like, <laughs> like since it's Poland, they think yeah. like, oh, another war is starting. Oh, it's just all a bunch of sex dolls floating. I've over. seen something <laughs> like that online before. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, this is a children's cartoon. No, no, this is oh. this, like, this <laughs> it, it 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 is like animation, like a kids' cartoon. But it's like Rick and Morty. It's for yeah. adults. Okay. It's funny though because it's like the animation looks exactly. It, I I would not be surprised if it's the same one as uh, Flapjack. Yeah, uh, yeah. So. Yeah, that's very cool. I had a yeah. Speaking of sex toy, I had when, when I was in college. Um, I really fucking hated my life there. Yeah, because I didn't, I did not want to go to college. Like my, my choice was like, okay, you're on the street, broke, all the locks are changed, or you go to college. So I went to college, and um, I was gonna go on a double date with one of my friends, uh, Sean, 
who knows me as Filthy Phil. I don't, I think I should just keep going by Filthy Phil from now. That's on. a pretty good one. Thank you. But sure. um, it's a good nickname. He uh, we we were going on this double date with like these two Italian chicks, and they were totally like stereotypical, like fucking Jersey Shore, just broads. You yeah. Know? And he's like, no, dude, he, like like I I'm he's in the mindset of like, yo, we gotta get laid, and I'm like still heartbroken for an old breakup so i'm like i don't give a fuck about these bitches man fuck them and we they invite us into their room while they're showering i'm like oh here watch this watch this and i'm like i wanted to because i was already really drunk so i wanted to like uh just kind of piss them off by putting their panties on my head yeah and i I go through i'm like oh fuck i found her vibrator yeah and the oh my god this is so bad I wanted, I'm like, dude, take a quick picture of me. She's almost coming out. And I pull my pants all the way down, have my boxers on. I was going to pull my boxers down, but I started coming out. I'm like, here, make it look like I'm I'm using the vibrator on my asshole. And he takes the picture. I'm like, all right, we're going to post this on our page. The picture got shared a shitload before I realized what the joke was. And the joke was that my sack was hanging out like three <laughs> inches down. <laughs> so the joke was on me. <laughs> so. So yeah, that 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 we, we never went out after. <laughs> I would say not. Yeah, that uh, really f- killed your chances on that one. Yeah, right. Who the fuck? All right, anybody looking for a three-inch sack? This guy right here. All right. I've got a I've got a friend whose mom works for Playboy. If you want me to make the introduction, we can make a career out of this. Yeah, I mean, those sex the, the, those sex dolls today. Yeah, are fucking insane. N- I mean, are they? Have you see, have you seen some of them now? No. <laughs> Like, like like the virtual the the ones yeah, that I've like fucking them, yeah. computer nerds are making like yeah like what thank God for the nerds like that no like like some of them are pr- they, they look exactly like, like legitimately a fucking human. real yeah I think really? they have like really molded like human teeth yeah and then uh, some of them actually have a pro like you program them on a skill level yeah like if how to play them hard to get so it's not like just like it's like oh do you want to be a fuck buddy. Or is this hard to get? Or do you want this to be a rape? You know, like <laughs> oh, fuck. And that's fun. Yeah. Whatever happened to just looking up stuff on Pornhub? Right. Yeah, come right. on. I mean, come on. That's right. <laughs>